Hello, this is Vivian Stewart, the Virtual Librarian at Southwest Tennessee Community College. If you're taking anatomy and physiology classes, this video will show you some of the valuable resources that we have to offer. So I'm starting at our library's homepage, which is www.southwest.tn.edu forward slash library. If you're looking for hardback books that you can use in addition to your textbook, you would use CyberCat, which is our online catalog. I'm going to Electronic Databases, and the first place we're going is Electronic Books. So if you're looking for books in addition to your textbooks, I would suggest you look for Anatomy and Physiology in our eBrary collection, or use some of the books in our Net Library collection. So when this opens up, I will perform a search for anatomy and physiology. And now search. There are 299 books that are available. We can also change our publication dates, which will change the number of results we have. But as I scroll down, I want you to see that you're provided with a picture of the book. The titles of the books are listed in blue, and you have three options. Ebook full text is how you would open up the book and start reading it online, or you can expand the table of contents and go to a certain chapter and start reading, or with special instructions from our staff, you can download this book offline to your own device and have access to it for up to seven days. I'm closing this out. Next, I'm going to the category of Medicine, and I'm going to the Health and Wellness Resource Center, and there's something entitled Trusted Sites, and now there's a category for Anatomy, and there's something entitled A Guided Tour. So you could come here and you can look at various 2D and 3D um, images. I'm closing this out. Next, I'm going to the category of Multimedia, and I want you to see Ambrose Video. There's something entitled Miracle of the Human Body that is available. So you can watch the entire video on a certain system, or you could break it down into smaller segments. So this is Miracle of the Human Body. This is what is available. Next, I'm going to the Master Academic Collection. Now, of course, you can easily type in a search topic, or you can look at the various subject headings that are listed in bold. There's a category entitled Health and Medicine, and I'm clicking on View All Titles. And there's an area for Human Anatomy and Physiology. So I am expanding Human Anatomy and Physiology. And there are 260 titles. So now I have some recommendations for you. And you don't have to use these recommendations, but I think these are the best videos to watch. So on page one, there's a series entitled The Body in Motion. If I click on the series here. These are the titles that are available. I'm going back. Also on page one, there's something entitled Anatomy Functional Body Systems, which is here. It's 27 minutes long, and these are the systems that it covers. I'm going back. Now there are 11 pages, so now I'm going to page two. And there's something entitled The Human Body, How It Works, which is here. And these are the videos that you can watch. I'm going back. And next we're going to page three. And there's something entitled The Incredible Human Machine, which is here. This is 96 minutes long, and these are the different segments that makes up this entire video. I'm going back. 
Next we're going to page four. And there's something entitled Anatomy for Beginners. Anatomy for Beginners is what I'm looking for, which is here. And then these are the videos that are available in this series. I'm going back. Next we're going to page five. And there's something entitled the Human Body Video Clip Collection, which is here. There are supposed to be 52 video clips that are available. This is 65 minutes long and then the various segments are listed. I'm going back. We are going to page 7 now. And I'm looking for something entitled the virtual body. The series is here. And these are the videos that is available in this series. I'm going back. And now we're going to page 9. And there's something entitled the new living body that we will be looking for. Here is the series. These are the videos available in the New Living Body. The original version of this was entitled Simply the Living Body and you can find that series on page 11. So keep in mind these are recommendations only. I'm closing this out. And lastly we're going to the category of Science. And we have the Human Body, How It Works your various um, body systems are listed over to, to the um, left. We will simply click on a green link in order to open up a module. Of course you can read through the text or you have the ability to listen to it if you want to work on something else. Your chapters are listed over to the left hand side. You're provided with a glossary. You're provided with an image gallery and you're provided with a video gallery and you can watch the videos. Closing this out, next we're going to Anatomy and Physiology Online. We will simply click here. There are 19 modules or units that is provided. So we want to go to the Muscular System. You have various navigations over to the side that you can go through and there's an arrow which it continues down. This tells you what you should know. Over to the right hand side, this is where mainly you have your textual information and also there may be some videos over here also. The, inter the interactive part is located here in the middle and you have icons which will allow you to zoom in or zoom out or you may rotate your image around. You may even um, add layers or move layers. There is a topic quiz that you could take and it will grade it for you. You can do a module quiz. There are case studies. There's also a category that says clinical and aging. You can perform a search to go to a certain area or you can look at the index. It's most important that you log out when you get through because we only have a certain number of licenses. We're closing this all the way out. And now I am back at our electronic databases and we're going next to Atom. Now the first time you use Atom you will need to download the software. And it does not take long to download the software and this will not hurt your computer at all. You will need to contact the staff in order to get a username and password. I think I typed that incorrectly. And we'll simply quickly go through this. You have a dissectable anatomy part. And you can always change this to male, female, or you could change the culture to where it's African American, Asian, Hispanic. We have an atlas anatomy. 
we have a 3D anatomy, you have clinical illustrations, there's clinical animations, and these are videos that you can watch, and then there is an encyclopedia. Now we have a video on using Atom that is on our YouTube um, page, so it will go through the various functions and, and search strategies that you can use. Make sure that you log out when you're finished. We are leaving our electronic databases page. Now I'm going back to the library's home page and we're going to Distance Education Library InfoNet. Up on the quick searches, I just want to point out that we have a quick search for anatomy and physiology where you have a list of the databases that I've just shown you. These are two um, videos that I recommend you look at. And then these are two websites that I am suggesting that you can use also. I am going back and going back one more page. And up on the recommended websites, if you would go to the category of research, there's an option for a visual dictionary. And just simply click on human body. And what you would do is to select a graphic and it will then display the various parts for you. I'm closing this out. I'm going back to the library's home page. So this is a listing of some of the resources that we have that is available. So we hope that you will find this to be helpful and that you will share this information with others. And as always, we welcome any comments that you may have. Have a great day.